video. This is a video on how to measure your plant height for the related bean stock competition. And when you are measuring your soybean plant for competition, this is the step that you're going to want to do first. Uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is grab something to measure with. Um, a meter stick, yard stick, or a tape measure will do just fine. And you're going to take your soybean plant, and if it is kind of lying down like ours is, or doing anything else, you can hold it up um, straight, or you can even stake it up if you want. And you're going to take whatever you're Whatever you're using to measure and put it right at the base of the soil, you don't want to dig it in or hold it above the soil, just right at the base where the, your soybean is coming out. And you're going to hold this up um, and mark where it is. And you are not allowed to take any of these other leaves and stretch them up as high as you can. You just need to measure from the base of your plant to where it hits the neck. So this is the, the apical pod and for measuring where that is, and right now we're at 62 centimeters. Whereas if you were to try and measure from this trifoliate leaf, you would be up to like 71 centimeters, which is not an accurate representation of height. Um, you're also definitely going to want to measure this in centimeters, not inches. And you're also going to want to take a picture of the soybean plant beside your measuring stick and submit that with your height as well. Um, this is important because plant height is a good indicator of plant growth as the plant is phototrophic and will grow towards the light. So if you're in a low light environment, you might get very long and leggy. It also might grow like this one's doing sideways to try and get towards light. So how the plant grows sideways upwards and how broad it gets is a good indication of its conditions in regards to light. Um, also, how tall it is versus how wide it is is an indication of plant spacing. So, if you have your plants very close together, they might grow to be taller, or if you have them spaced far apart, they might grow to be bushier. Um, I hope this helps. And let us know if you have any questions by emailing us at our Planet Beanstalk email account. Thanks for watching, and good luck.